Space exploration has been ongoing since the earliest days of human civilization, with some of the oldest remaining records showing evidence of our attempts to launch ourselves into space. From the primitive rockets of the past to the complex spacecraft of today, the journey of humanity into the unknown has always been an amazing one. In this Liberty Space Exploration episode, we'll travel back in history and look at some of the incredible milestones of space exploration and how they help shape our current understanding of our place in the universe. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, and comment to participate in this fascinating topic. What was the launch pad for space exploration? When did it truly commence? The launch pad for space exploration can be traced back to the Cold War era, when the United States and the Soviet Union were engaged in a fierce competition to demonstrate their technological superiority. However, the dawn of space exploration can be traced back to October 4, 1957, when the Soviet Union launched the first artificial satellite, Sputnik 1, into Earth's orbit. This groundbreaking mission marked a significant milestone in human history and ignited the fierce competition between the United States and the Soviet Union, known as the Space Race. Sputnik 1 was a small spherical satellite measuring just 58 centimeters, 23 inches in diameter and weighing approximately 83.6 kilograms, 184 pounds. Despite its modest size, the impact of its launch was monumental. The satellite's primary objective was to test the feasibility of launching an object into Earth's orbit and to gather data on the density of the upper atmosphere. Sputnik 1 was equipped with two radio transmitters that emitted a continuous beeping signal which could be picked up by radio operators around the world. This audible proof of the satellite's presence in orbit captured the attention of people worldwide and demonstrated the Soviet Union's technological prowess. The successful launch of Sputnik 1 had far-reaching implications. It not only signaled the beginning of the space age, but also intensified the rivalry between the United States and the Soviet Union. In response to Sputnik 1, the United States accelerated its efforts to develop and launch its own satellite culminating in the successful launch of Explorer 1 on January 31, 1958. The legacy of Sputnik 1 extends beyond the initial shock and awe of its launch. It spurred a rapid expansion of scientific research and technological advancements in both the United States and the Soviet Union. The pursuit of space exploration led to the development of powerful rockets, sophisticated satellites, and eventually manned space missions. On May 25, 1961, President John F. Kennedy delivered a historic speech before a joint session of Congress that would forever change the course of space exploration and solidify the United States' commitment to winning the space race against the Soviet Union. This speech, which outlined the ambitious goal of sending an American astronaut to the moon and returning him safely to Earth, by the end of the decade marked a pivotal moment in the ongoing competition between the two superpowers. The backdrop of Kennedy's speech was a tense period in history as the Cold War between the United States and the Soviet Union continued to escalate. The launch of Sputnik 1 in 1957 had shocked the world and left the United States scrambling to catch up with its rivals' technological achievements. The Soviet Union's successful orbiting of Yuri Gagarin, the first human in space, in April 1961 only heightened the sense of urgency within the United States to assert its dominance in space exploration. In his speech, Kennedy acknowledged the challenges that lay ahead and called for a national effort to achieve this ambitious goal. He emphasized the importance of investing in science, technology, and education stating that no single space project in this period will be more impressive to mankind or more important for the long-range exploration of space. Kennedy's words inspired a generation of Americans to dream big and strive for greatness. 
The speech galvanized the nation, leading to a surge in funding for NASA and the establishment of the Apollo program. Over the following years, the United States made significant strides in space exploration, culminating in the successful landing of Apollo 11 on the moon on July 20, 1969. The impact of Kennedy's space race speech extended beyond the realm of space exploration. It fostered a spirit of innovation and collaboration that would drive advancements in various fields from telecommunications to medical research. The pursuit of space exploration also served as a symbol of unity during a time of global tension, bringing people together in their first shared fascination with the cosmos, including the first landing on the moon event. The first landing on the moon event was a historical achievement for humankind. It represented not only a giant leap into space exploration, but also a moment of unity and pride for people all around the world. The images of Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin walking on the lunar surface were beamed to millions of televisions, captivating audiences with the realization that humans could venture beyond the confines of Earth. The Apollo 11 mission marked a significant milestone in human history and sparked a newfound interest in space exploration. The images of Armstrong and Aldrin stepping out of the lunar module and planting the American flag on the moon's surface became iconic symbols of human achievement. The mission also paved the way for future space missions, leading to the establishment of space stations and sending rovers to explore other planets in our solar system. Space agencies around the world continue to work towards the goal of sending humans to Mars and beyond, inspired by the groundbreaking achievements of the Apollo program. The success of the Apollo 11 mission was a testament to the power of human ingenuity and determination, and it inspired generations of scientists, engineers, and explorers to push the boundaries of what is possible. Today, space exploration continues to be an important area of research and development, with numerous countries and private companies working to advance our understanding of the cosmos. The quest to explore space dates back to the early days of human civilization, when our ancestors looked up at the night sky and wondered about the stars, planets, and other celestial bodies. Over the centuries, we have made tremendous progress in unlocking the secrets of the universe, from Galileo's telescopic observations of Jupiter's moons to the recent discovery of gravitational waves. Space exploration has always had a profound impact on technology and innovation, leading to advancements in fields such as materials science, robotics, and artificial intelligence. One of the most significant impacts of space exploration has been the development of satellite technology. Satellites have revolutionized communication, weather forecasting, navigation, and even the way we watch television. They have also contributed to scientific research by providing data on everything from climate patterns to geological formations. In addition, the technology used to create and launch satellites has led to advancements in rocketry and propulsion systems, which have furthered our understanding of space and enabled us to explore farther than ever before. Overall, space exploration has been a catalyst for technological progress and innovation, pushing humanity to constantly pushing the boundaries of what is possible. As we continue to push the boundaries of what we know about the cosmos, we are also learning about ourselves and our place in the universe. Even today, the legacy of the moon landing continues to inspire and motivate us to reach for the stars and have inspired this episode of Liberty. Thank you for joining us along with this exploration. Please be sure to subscribe, like, share, and comment on this remarkable event and other future episodes you would like for us to feature.